Hey everybody, it's me, Sung Won, and today we're going to be opening up another Tokyo Treat. Thank you, Tokyo Treat, for sending this. If you want to get your own Tokyo Treat, use the link below and the coupon code PROZ to get $3 off your first Tokyo Treat Premium Box, You may Twins, Twins Box, or NMNL Box. Um, use the link in the code. Okay, this looks new. Champagne Soda Pop. Comes a little toothpick. Oh, and one fell out. Okay. They're basically little ramen -y gummies. A little too chewy for me. Here is a do-it-yourself kit. Um, this is the Odan, Odan Goya-san, a little wagashi kit. I don't know what wagashi is, but I guess it's kind of like rice cakes or something. So I'll do this in a separate video. Here's some kalbi uh, satsumaimon. Oh, it's a sweet potato snack with the addition of cream cheese. Huh, sweet potato and cream cheese. Okay. I'm not a big sweet potato guy, but let's try it out. These are actually pretty damn good. Um, they work because it really tastes like a real potato. Not like a super um, fried and kind of like overly salted thing. It really tastes like a sweet potato, like, and they're very thick cut. Um, and then it tastes like it has like kind of like a sour cream or cream cheese tang. So these are actually pretty addictive. Hmm. These are great, actually. I'm just, I'm, I'm one over. Wow. That's how you do a sweet potato snack. Not too sweet. Just lets its natural sweetness with the addition of a little bit of a savory, creamy taste. Oh man. Dope. Here's a um, Kome Hello Kitty Ramen. Uh, sour, Kome is a popular sour plum franchise. Okay, so these are heart shaped ramen candies that come in fizzy apple soda and sour plum flavors. Okay, I'll try it. Oh, it's a little hot. That one's a sour plum. Um, not bad. Sour plum. I kind of like it more in like um like an onigiri, like a savory context, in terms of a sweet candy context. A little too sour for me, but not bad. Here's Haichu Premium uh, Red Grape. Okay, 98% of the juice used in these come from Italian Cabernet Sauvignon grapes. Wow, very fancy. Okay, the grape flavor is quite good. Otherwise, though, it's just kind of like a it's like a chewier Haichu. Well, the grape flavor is good, but. It's not like, ooh, it's a premium haichu. Here's a little Disney Tsum Tsum uh, flashlight pan. My wife will love this because she loves Tsum Tsums. And it looks like it has a flashlight too. That's awesome. Here's some Chipstar Shinshu Wasabi. Hmm, okay. Let's see how intense the wasabi flavor is. It's salty, but wasabi. And it does have a nice wasabi flavor. Got the nice spice, um, like that sort of nasal heat. Not crazy hot, but the flavor is quite good. Really nice wasabi flavor. Here's a Doraemon um, Genki Jelly Drink. It's a great fl flavored jelly drink. Let's try it out. Honestly, I'm not crazy about these jelly drink things, but this one actually has a nice grape flavor. It's just as good as those Haichus, actually. So I'm a fan. I like this. I like it. Kind of wish it was just juice, but you know what? It's pretty good. Here's some Hello Kitty Strawberry Pocky. Or I'm sorry, Hello Kitty Strawberry Pretzels. Uh, not Pocky. Okay. I love strawberry Pocky or um, strawberry pretzel sticks. And these are no exception. Just sweet, creamy strawberry flavor. Here is Kinako Mochi Crackers. Uh, light and airy rice crackers coated in roasted soy flour, special sugar, and cinnamon. Mm. Oh, they're very small and very thin. It's a delicate little cracker. Oh. The powder has a very strong sweet flavor. Um, and it's coated in it. There's a ton of powder on there. So yeah, it hits you with that sort of sweet soy flavor. Nice solid cracker. Um, really strongly flavored. Here's some Jaga Bee. Um, I've had these before, but the Yuzu Salt. It's a Yuzu, which is like a citrus fruit. And, uh, salt flavor. Yeah, it's like these french fry snacks. I'm not convinced that the citrus flavor needed to be there, but they're good crunchy salty fry snacks, so you can't really go wrong. Here's some Pikachu Ramen. These are the ones that kind of change in uh, color and flavor as you suck them. So I think it's strawberry at first. Oops, bit into it, but yeah, as soon as you bite into it, there's a melon flavor. They're so crunchy though, I probably wouldn't even suck on them. I would just crunch them because they're just crunchy little addictive candies. Ooh, this is what I'm about. Um, this is a Crunky One Punch Man bar. I love Crunky. Ooh, with cookies and cream flavor. Comparing this to, say, my favorite, my favorite candy bar is Hershey's Cookies and Cream. And this is similar, but it's slightly different because Japanese cookies and cream 
or like vanilla chocolate or whatever, has a milkier taste, like a creamier, lighter, milkier taste, which I like. It's also light and crispy instead of like the big Oreo chunks. So it's like a nice kind of like lighter bar, but still very creamy and delicious. And finally, oh man, I might have to save this box because it has my favorite anime or manga or anime on it, Chihaya Furu on it. This is Topo Chihaya Furu Fruit Tart Flavor. This box is gorgeous. I might save this box because I love how it looks. I love that, that all the characters are on it. Okay. Super crispy. I love that. Super light and crispy and thin. And the inside has that nice cream. It has a nice light. Uh, fruity flavor. Nice. And it's Chihaya Fru, so bonus. Alright, that was Tokyo Treat. If you want to get your own, use the link below in the code. Otherwise, I'll see you all next time.